Ryan Fox is a Kiwi golfing legend, a pro for over 10 years. He's showing no signs of slowing down. He's just celebrated the biggest win of his career after a shaky start to his final round. Fox oh, back on the tee here at the third and he hates it. Straight right and a long way right. A hammer blow for the very likeable Kiwi. But Ryan rallied. Mr. To beat the star-studded field at the BMW PGA Championship. A gold star performance. With another title to defend this weekend, is he ready to do it all again? Uh, goosebumps, yeah. Please welcome Ryan Fox. Thank you. Oh, I'm doing uh, really well. Thanks, Ryan. Uh, we just saw the clip of that impressive win at the BMW Champs a couple of weeks ago. Now, for the non-golfer watching, can you talk? Talk us through what that means for you career-wise, that win. Um, I mean, it's huge, to be honest. It's it's our biggest event in Europe um, outside of the Open Championship. So, yeah, a lot of the best in the world were playing. Um, so to get a chance to beat them down the stretch is pretty cool. Yeah, there was a nice little paycheck on top of that as well. <laughs> <laughs> that pressure, though, $2.6 million on the line. Do you have techniques to deal with those pressure situations? For me, it's, you put yourself in that situation enough times, it almost becomes habit. You know, it's like you getting up and speaking in front of a thousand people. You know, it's not intimidating anymore, but it would have been intimidating at some point. And although it was kind of a, a different situation, I've still had pressure parts before, and it was just another one of those kind of thing. And I, I left myself a nice, easy part and was, yeah, obviously pretty chuffed when it when it went in the end, and that's what you dream of growing up, to, to birdie the last to win a tournament, especially a big tournament like that in front of a massive crowd. It's it's pretty awesome. It's, so it's such a hard feeling to beat. Such a huge yeah. moment. I know for me, I, I would want to share in a moment like that with my family. Do you take them all on tour with you? Because that must be one of the hardest parts of your job. The family actually came, the first event they came to with as a as a four with the two kids was the Irish Open a couple of weeks ago. I uh, can't recommend trying to travel around the world with two kids. It's pretty hectic. <laughs> There's a lot of baggage, especially when you throw a set of golf clubs in there as well. <laughs> but, you know, I certainly wouldn't swap it. It's 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 a lot of fun. Um, and, yeah, it's, it's certainly better having them there than sitting in hotel rooms by myself for most of the time. <laughs> yeah, magic moments. Uh, speaking of family, if the All Blacks are playing the same time as you are, which one does your dad, former All Black legend Grant Fox, watch? <laughs> if, if I was in contention, I think Dad would pick me, but I think if it was a Thursday or a Friday and the All Blacks are playing a big game, I, I certainly wouldn't blame them for picking the All Blacks. <laughs> <laughs> Good to you. Now, you're coming to New Zealand for the Fox, which is a fundraiser for Waihi Beach, Lifeguard and Volunteer Coast Guard. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yeah, we've been doing it for a couple of years now. I think this will be the third instalment. Um, and it combines my two passions, golf and fishing. <laughs> we look after two great charities and have a whole lot of fun. And um, all I can wish for this year is we get a couple of good days of weather because both fishing and golf are, are not overly fun if the weather doesn't <laughs> play ball. And this weekend, you've got the Alfred Dunhill champs. You are the defending champion. Is that a different kind of pressure? Yeah, it's um, it's very cool. It's, obvious, it's another one of our iconic event, events. It's at, hosted at St Andrews, which is yeah. pretty special as a golfer. Yeah, so, yeah, pretty lucky to get to play there in a tournament and very lucky to have got to win there last year. Oh, amazing. Ryan, good luck for this weekend and thanks for chatting to us. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Hey, you love your golf. How long have you been playing golf for? 40 years plus. Sweet. Wow. Must yeah. be pretty good by now. Nope. <laughs> have you got a bit better over the 40 Not years? Not really. No. <laughs> it comes, comes and goes, but you've got to play regularly to get consistently uh -huh. better. So why do you keep playing that? I, you know, it's great. We're saying, um, friends were saying the other day, it's one of the things we do together as mates where we don't drink. Oh. I, mean, I mean, you can, but, you know, we don't. And um, it's a great walk. I get my steps up. Great exercise for me. And there's always one shot. Whenever you play a round of golf, there's always one shot where you go, oh, I'm pretty good at this. Yeah. <laughs> Keeps reeling you back in. One out of 100. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, this is pretty cool. If you are golf mad, you've got the chance to be Ryan Fox's caddy and his fishing buddy for that Fox event in December. All the details are on our Facebook page.